egg roll crab. <laughs> crabby, crabby. Oh boy. Oh boy. Yeah, another crab's treasure. Yeah. Hello, fan thieves. This is Jokestar45. And welcome to a new series of me playing another crab's treasure. That's right, guys. A few days ago, they, this came, you know, this game came out recently, like literally a few days ago. So yeah, I'm actually looking forward to playing uh, this game. And of course, I know the gimmick here. I know the gimmick. Like this game isn't just some ordinary cute little crab game. This is this is a Dark Souls game. It's, yeah, it's one of those games. And of course, like personally, like I, I'm not really a fan of Dark Souls games. Like I never even been in a Dark Souls game. But of course, I decided like after a few years, well, I decided to try out a, a Dark Souls esque clone game, which is another crab's treasure. The reason the reason why I'm playing this is because it looks a lot basic and a lot you know easier than you know than playing Dark Souls or Elden Ring because you know it's all advanced there you know with spells, and healing, and you know all that. At least this game will show me, kind of show me the ropes on how to basically play a Dark Souls game. And of course, and of course, I am going to die a lot, obviously. So yeah, I'm going to enjoy dying in this poor crab game. Oh no, I'm like, oh, I'm not looking forward to seeing the poor little crab die. Uh, but yeah, I, I am gonna die a lot because I'm, I'm not familiar with Dark Soul, Dark Soul games. But yeah, uh, all right. So enough of me yabbering. Without further ado, let's start this new game. Okay, I guess no difficulty option. What word comes to mind when you think of the earth? For some, that word might be beautiful. Others might say the world is hateful or evil. Or unstable or full of shit. <laughs> but above all else, the word that best describes our world is resilient. Against the odds, time and time again, creatures adapt to make the most of their given environment. Some learn to feed on others, stealing their vitality for their own. Some become scavengers, living off what strangers leave behind. And others still, as we will soon see. Oh. We prefer to be simply left alone. Another crab's treasure. Yeah, this is where the story of the hermit crab begins. <laughs> Please open up. Oh, uh, you're not a bird. Sir, are you the owner of this residence? You mean my shell? Uh, yeah, it's mine. Do you like it? I represent the Royal Duchy of Slacktide, which has recently annexed the territory surrounding and including this tide pool. I'm here to inform you that you have outstanding taxes that date back at upwards of 10 tithes. <laughs> if you are presently unable to pay this balance, the duchy will claim your home until you- uh, Hold on, I've got some questions. First of all, uh, what's a duchy? Also, taxes? <laughs> okay, so basically, the Duchess of Slack Tide owns this whole area now. And she puts a lot of effort into keeping it safe. So, everyone who benefits from that has to abide by her rules and pay up once per tide. There's still plenty of birds here. I don't know if it's really safe. Look, kid, I don't have time to argue political <laughs> nuances here. I've got a lot of tax evaders to get. <laughs> you gotta pay up right now, or I'm gonna have to repo your property. Got it? Okay, okay. I think I've got a hard kelp or two around here somewhere. I'm actually getting threatened by that. <laughs> oh my gosh, okay. Sorry me the basics. Move. Okay, so I had to pay the loan shark m money, tax money, or else he's gonna. Oh no, or else this hermit crab's gonna become homeless. Oh, <laughs> change his voice. <laughs> You're gonna wait till the tide comes in, kid. Hurry up and find something to pay me with, or I'm gonna start getting serious. Oh boy. Okay, you don't wanna make him angry, <laughs> little crab guy. 
I don't even know his name. Or, duh, whatever. There. Oh, found your stash of heart kelp. Everyone loves these delicious heart kelp pods. So they're often used for trading. Eating just one of these will restore. Oh, so it heals you. Okay. Oh, oh, his name is Krill there. Okay, I gotta remember his name. Hopefully that is enough for taxes. Well, we gotta, well, that's life, little crab. You gotta pay your, your taxes so you don't go homeless. Your tax, you have to pay this, this, this fine gentleman the tax money. Hey, I know this isn't much, but... What the shell is this? <laughs> They're heart kelp pods. Don't tell me you don't even like heart kelp. I hope you're joking. No one uses these dumb things as money anymore. The ocean's moved to the trash standard now. Trash! You got it? T trash! So, like, no pearls either? No shiny pirate coins? That's right. None of that crap. So you better find some bread clips or some sauce packets back there. I'm losing my darn patience. Look, if, if you just give me a couple more tights... Alright, I heard enough. Say goodbye to your shell, idiot. <laughs> oh my gosh. Wait, wait! No, 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 no. Oh no! Oh no! <laughs> oh crab, 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 crab! Oh, oh no. He's homeless. Oh, I gotta chase him. Come back here. Give me my crab, uh, give me my shell back. My home. Son of a crab. Oh, already. So far, I like that. It's, I like that it's training me on the basics right now. Oh, come back here. For, get back here. I want my shell back. Gosh darn it. You lone shark. You can't do this to me, man. How am I supposed to stay safe from all the birds and stuff around here? Not my problem. You want your shell back? You better go get a job and pay up. <laughs> oh my gosh. I hear they're always hiring in the reef. Oh, what are you talking? You mean Mc McDonald's or something? Or McReef or McReef Nolds? <laughs> I mean, I guess Krill can work there. The reef? Isn't it super busy there? I don't want to talk to people. He's a shy little, little guy, huh? Again, really not my problem. I don't care where you get the trash from, but I'm keeping this until you do. See you later. Oh! Crab, 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 crab. <laughs> Give me my shell back. Oh, yeah. Now, this is where the real game begins. Okie dokie. Oh, I guess I know the lore now. Oh, hold X while jumping. Oh, I can swim. Oh, I can kind of glide. Okay, good to know. All right. Okay, good to know. Good to know. Okay. Oh, there's, a, there's an item over there. I need to get it. Oh, no! <laughs> I missed it. I need to get the item. Gosh darn it. Okay. Alright. Okay. Oh, yeah. I, I, I need to sprint and jump. Ah, oh, darn it. Come on. Jump! There. Okay, I made it. Okay, there we go. I just had to sprint. Son of a crab. Oh! No! <laughs> no. Oh, wait a minute. Oh, so I need stamina to climb? Oh, no, oh, no, wait, man, no, never mind. I don't need stamina to climb. It's not like Genshin. Okay, good to know. Come on. Okay, gotta try this again. Come on. Oh, okay, I made it. Yes, I made it. Oh, finally, it took me like three tries. Pick up bread claw. A small chunk of plastic in the shape of a crab's claw. Maybe it has some value. Oh, I can sell it. Wow, that's a lot of moolah to sell. Okay. I don't know if I take fall damage. I don't think I- No, duh, I don't take fall damage. I just jumped into the water and I don't take fall damage. Okay- Oh no! Oh hey! It's another crab! Excuse me sir, uh, did you see a really tall shark pass by carrying a super awesome dope looking shell? <laughs> Moaning crab. Work. That's what I'm trying to not do. What's why I gotta catch up with? Woof. This. Holy crab, what's wrong with your eyes? Have you been sleeping enough or- Oh god, get away from me! <laughs> oh no! I don't- I can't fight. Ow! Okay, I have to run. Oh no, this is scary. What the heck is going on here? 
Oh. Run, little crab. Run. Oh. Oh. Oh, oh run. <laughs> I'm scared. I'm scared. Oh. oh okay. Okay. <laughs> What's wrong with you? Are they all high on something? Jeez. I think I lost them. I knew the ocean could be sketchy, but I had no idea it was this bad. Oh, it is. It's already bad. Oh, boy. Oh, wait. A fork. Oh. This is just like the, the sword in the stone. Give me the fork. Oh, triangle. Uh, I, I guess it couldn't hurt to have a way to defend myself. This thing seems like it could do a little damage. If anyone else attacks me, I guess I'll poke him with the pokey bit. <laughs> Might as well give this bad boy a few practice swings. Sure, I'll like to do that before I actually fight. Found a rusty fork. Press R1 to swing the fork. Oh, that's it? Pretty basic, I guess. I mean, yeah, obviously it's pretty basic. R1 to attack. Okay. Okay, so... Yeah, his swings are slow. So I gotta remember that. And then charge attack. Okay, yeah, hold R1. Alright, alright. Pretty simple. See, guys, I mean, this is a pretty simple Dark Souls game so far. But wait a minute, there's something up there. I don't know if I can reach it. Uh, I don't know. I don't think I can reach that. Okay, yeah. I, whatever. I guess I'm supposed to come back later. Hopefully, I, I don't mess up. Hopefully, I don't goof up. Oh, wait. Focusing on an... Oh, okay. Press R3 to focus on enemies, keeping the camera locked to them. This is really useful for fighting, so don't forget about that. Got it. Okay, so I can lock on targets. Oh, this is like Zoldo. What the heck? There. Alright, pretty simple. Pretty simple. These enemies are pretty simple to kill. Dodge attack. Okay. Tap circle. Wait. Tap circle right as the enemy attacks to dodge out of the way. The timing takes some practice, but dodging successfully can avoid most damage. Okay, so they really like Dark, dark Souls. Ow! Okay. No! I'm gonna die already! No, no, no. Oh, okay. I'm sorry, I'm okay there. Die, 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 get out of here. Oh my gosh, it would have been embarrassing if I die here. Oh Okay. Oh yeah, I'm not good at dodging yet. I'm no expert at dodging. Oh they dropped health though. Okay, good. That's good, that's good. So far there's no music. Oh so whatever. I'm sure music is gonna play later. Glide dead. So far, it's pretty, pretty simple. I'm, I'm glad it gave me time to learn. Oh wait, ah, wait, what's this? What's that? Okay, I don't know what. I guess okay, crystals? Question mark. I guess I can use it to upgrade like abilities or something. Let me go back real quick. Hmm, I don't know how to. Okay, whatever. I'll come. You know, yeah, whatever. I'm not gonna backtrack. Uh, hopefully, I didn't goof up. Maybe there was a way to get up there and that DNA thingamajiggy, but I guess, I, whatever. I think I'm supposed to come back there later. So, whatever. I'm just going to continue forward. Come on. Little crabby. Oh, wait a minute. Oh, duh. Okay. Yeah, that's where I was. Okay, I was going to... Okay, it was going to take me up here anyways. Whoa, what's that thing? What's that DNA thingamajiggy? The currents start getting warm close to this little platform. It's kind of comfy. Maybe I could rest my little feet here for a little while. I'm resting my little feet. <laughs> my little crab feet. Alright, that's enough resting. Let's go keep going. What the heck? Touch current. Oh, is this like the bonfire? Moon snail shell found. Moon snail shells. Touch these glowing currents to restore a long forgotten moon snail shell, which you can rest and restore health. If you're slain, you'll revive at, at the last one you stay at, so be sure to activate everyone, okay? Yeah, it is like the bonfire. Sure, I'll, I'll chill. I'll chill in here. Oh my crab. Oh, what the heck? Level up? Microplastics and leveling up, okay? The power pres present in moon snail shells will allow you to purge microplastics from yourself gaining strength in the process however certain folks might be interested in trading for your extra microplastics so you might want to consider savings okay 
So it's either I level up my crab, or I or like I use microplastics to level up my crab, or I just save them for this for shopping later. Well, obviously I can't buy anything. It's expensive. Inflation. Of course, I'm not surprised the ocean has inflation. Oh, it shows you all the shell collections. My home. I want to get my home back. All right. Well, there's nothing else I can do. All right, moving forward. Ah, you jerk! Give my, give my home back! Give me my home! There you are! Wow, you're all full of resist. I think I've been pretty clear with you, kid. This shell's the property of the Dutchess now. This is what happens when you don't pay your taxes on time. If you want it back, take it up with her, not me. My work is done here. But come on, man. There's gotta be something I can do. Yeah, now that you mention it, I can think of something. You can lick my freaking ventral fins and stop bothering me. Ah, later, kid. Ah, this guy. <laughs> Gosh darn lone shark. I'm gonna kill that shark guy. Oh, what the heck? The lag. Or right, whatever. There we go. Now the real game begins. The shallows. What the? What the crab? Is a snail. Whoa, whoa, whoa! Don't see your type leaving the tide pool too often. Yeah, well, I didn't have a choice. Can you tell me what's going on here? I heard there's like a duchess in charge now. Yep, sure is. Real piece of work. Takes all my hard-earned microplastics every tide just for existing around here. And what do I see for it? Nothing. Just keeps building up her castle and hiring more soldiers to defend it, dude. Oh, that's cool. Where can I find her? I think she has something of mine. Pal, just look around for a moment and you'll probably figure it out. Or did you miss that huge castle in the distance, dude? Or am I tripping? Okay, great. I'll head over there. Hopefully she can get rid of my taxes for me. Oh, I see how it is. You're some kind of freeloader, are you? <laughs> I mean, that's technically true. Krill is a freeloader. Bet you think you can skirt your taxes without the rest of us keep th this society together, do you? You just said the ooh hermit crabs are all the same. Wearing the shells, the rest of us work so hard to create with our own mantles. Yeah, I mean, hey, that's real life for you. People... A lot of people, a lot of, I'm sure a lot of snails out there, they're working their, their snails off, keeping their snails home, while Krill, you know, he just wants to become a freeloader and, and live tax-free all the time, or live home free, pretty much. You have to have stayed in your tide pool, small fry. Hey, I never did anything to you, man. Yeah, well, how about I do something to you, dude? Oh, oh, it's gonna hurt me. Die! <laughs> I murdered him! <laughs> I murdered him. Why does everyone in this place try to kill me? <laughs> oh, that was hilarious. I murdered an innocent bystander. This shell doesn't even fit! Alright, calm down, Krill. This is the most dangerous situation you've been in since seagull breeding season. But all you gotta do is make it to that castle like the root snail said. It sounds like the Duchess controls the taxes around here, so I bet the shark took my shell to her. I'm sure once I tell her what's going on, this can all be resolved and I can get go right back to sleep. In other words, become a freeloader. What a waste of time. There's no way I'm fitting in this thing. Okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, I know what to do. But if I lay down 